All right, so the next outfit we have for Christmas is with Fess Merlin. Now, I'm not gonna lie, she she she's a classy woman. You feel me? Uh, uh, definitely got some aesthetics. You feel me? Definitely got them aesthetics. But yeah, we're gonna be using her in um ungear, just showcasing the outfits. You know, again, it's really really cool. Again, oh my gosh, she looks. Yo, she got them hips. I can't even get, but yeah, yeah. Oh my god, I gotta. Uh, we're gonna be using PvP. Uh, we're gonna play with this team and then hopefully get some W's with this Merlin. You know, hopefully showcase some of her uh, just, just some of her aesthetics. You feel me? So hopefully you guys enjoy. Again, PvP rule: if you have all different race allies, you gain 30% base stats. So enjoy. All right, let's see what we got here. Um, got a cool, sexy team. Now we get like good debuffs with Merlin. That'd be lovely. So we're just gonna do this. Again, Merlin cut out looked pretty good. Looks really good. So we're gonna end up debuffing. Again, we kind of abusing Merlin debuffs. Now a lot of people also use like Mer Lolly Merlin instead of this Merlin. I guess because the debuffs are really really good though. I mean, a lot of people prefer, prefer having the infects. Um, the infects definitely are really beneficial for Merlin and them. So we're just going to end up probably just using maybe Merlin card, you know, get that good old um, look. I, I really want to try to have our ultimates. Do y'all think I'll be able to get our ultimates? Uh I just want to see the ultimate cut in. Cut in. I ain't gonna lie to you. I just want to see the ultimate cut in. I wish I had like a Taxel on Escanor, because I'm a little bit afraid of the Escanor like doing like crazy damage to me, low key. But I got. I have like all three of them have corrosion. Oh my god. Unfortunately, all three of them have corrosion. Okay, Liz is disabled. Um, I also have Red Tarmio on my list. So if he targets her, oh no, don't be four gauge. Don't be four gauge. Actually, it didn't really matter. Now that I looked at my gauge, I was like, wait, hold up. It would just merge together. Oh, that did good damage too. Um, all right, let's see this cut in right here. Um, he should be forcing a revive on himself. And so I'm just gonna use regular cards. Cause he should revive. Ooh, look how look how good that looks. Look how good that looks. You feel me? Um Oh my god, Deanne is still alive? How? Why the heck is Deanne still alive? <laughs> how is she still alive? <laughs> what the heck? God dang, how tanky is she? I'm trying to get the win animation with freaking Merlin. This man tanking like it ain't nothing. All right, Eskinor are gonna be uh, lose his flames. Dang, I thought I would be able to get the win animation with uh, Merlin with this one, but it's not looking too good with Deanne right here. Deanne look like she's ready to like blast me. Yep, blast. Bow. Pretty close. Pretty close to blasting me right there. Um I guess I can try to do this maybe. But I think Eskinar is just gonna kill. Let's see. I mean hopefully he doesn't, but I already think he is. I think he is. Yep. Death. <laughs> just death. I wanted the Merlin win animation, but I'll take it, man. Alright. It's time it's time to uh get the Merlin. Merlin time, boys. Um, should I just abuse his Eskner low key? Like he's running. I guess the uh, the sucky thing is he's running freaking Gother, which is annoying. Uh, so we're gonna probably blast Gother. Gother is usually like the bigger threat. Um, when you got it paired next to Eskinor, because what could happen is if you accidentally like you know blast Eskner and he ends up having zero percent, you might end up having Merlin. I said Merlin. Um, Gotha give him a gold card. So you want to get rid of Gotha first. Which is why I'm a little bit confused on why he's running this type of team. Instead of Liz. Because usually Gotha teams, like they run like Red Tarmiel on Gotha. So having Deanne, you kind of force yourself in a in that pickle. You feel me? And he has a stun. He has double stuns, by the way. So if he ends up Oh man, I really don't have a good hand, but but I was gonna say like if he ends up, you know, giving me ultimate, that would be nice. 
Like, I wouldn't need another Merlin card. Nah, I would've been disabled. Probably not another Merlin card. Okay, he targets Escanor, which is fine. So what we're gonna do right here is we're gonna AoE. And then he should be end up double getting double stun right here, which leads to Escanor being able to uh target him without having his taunt up because he's gonna be double stun. So let's see what happens right here. So we AoE. There's another AoE. This should be the stun. And now we should be able to do damage right now. Forcing probably the revives on Escanor. Oh, we don't even force a revive. That's actually really good for us then. Because now he can't do anything. Like, look at his hand. He has two car he has two cards to his name. We can do almost anything. We can go for freaking uh, Deanne. We can go for Escanor. You name it. Let's see what he does. Uh oh, he goes for um Deanne. Okay. Makes sense. He targets Escanor for a reason I do not know. So we can just force revive then. Yeah, we can just force revive. If his internet like works. Well, this is me. No, that's not even me right now. This is this is his internet most likely. Sometimes it do be me where my internet be messing up sometimes. Um, it has done that a couple of times lately. But this time this is this is on him. All right, I want that extra skill damage boost. I'm not gonna lie to you. Oh, look at that damage, man. He's on his final flames, and this should do mega damage. Yep. Bye bye, Liz. Now it's just you for flame, Escanor. I wonder if he's gonna target me. Please do, like, please do attack, so I can get the the Merlin uh, win animation for for the boys. Back home. Ah, don't forfeit. Don't forfeit. Don't forfeit. Don't you dare forfeit. I need this win animation. Oh, no. Oh, my God. He forfeit. GG. Man, that boy Grimoire is like butt cheeks now. Unfortunate. Yo, this is, this is a crazy team. This is a team I wanted to try to use like with Grimano. It's just that her CC is like atrocious. So I'd never really like try to use her. Hopefully I'll be able to um get the win animation with Merlin with this match. I don't know. I feel like Mono's passive just like it's very restrictive. Like obviously Brunhill became a better Mer a better um mono when time when like all the time being used because her pass is less restrictive. Wow, Mono's passive is very restricted where you need like just her debuffs only. Which is very unfortunate. Especially because in PvP, you want to have as much debuff as possible for some teams. Especially when you're using like Zelda and stuff. So being that uh, very restrictive really just made her feel like, like sucky in some parts of PvP. All right, so we're going to just do some damage real quick. All right. I didn't even realize he, she was like freaking Red Tarmion Link. I ain't going to lie to you. I didn't even realize that. Good thing uh, I have the attacks on her. I guess that's going to do something for me. Um, I could just push for my ultimate right now. Unless he debuffs me. Because, again, I want to try to get that win animation with Merlin. Just so I can see how it looks with this outfit on. You never know what could happen. <laughs> Let's see what we can do. Um, dang. Okay. Did this kill? Let's find out. Uh, okay. Obviously, he's not going to get rid of Merlin that easy. I just need to make sure, like, my Merle isn't gonna get rid of his Zeldris. Let's see. I need to see this this outfit in action. Oh, oh, let's go. Let's see how it looks. Let's see how it looks with the win animation. Let's see how it looks. Okay, that's hot. That's hot. All right, let's see what we can do. 
Yami, you're you're in trouble. You're in trouble, buddy. Yami, you are in deep, deep waters. So we're just gonna end up just doing this. You know, get off a little bit debuff damage real quick. Ritarmiel on on Eskinar. That's some that's some um disgusting behavior right there. Oh my god. Disgusting. Red Tarmiel on Eskinar is crazy though. Red Tarmiel Eskinar is crazy, man. Can't even lie. That is kind of crazy. Um, AoE too. So this man just has like infinite HP now. Dang, man. He, this man had to be built different, huh? He couldn't just be like a regular human being. He said, yo, I need that red Tarmio shenanigans. Um, I might as well just do this, right? And then hopefully get rid of you. Hopefully. Hopefully gets rid of Merlin as well at the same time. Yeah, we should be doing like good damage. Just because Merlin gets hit with crits very easily. And then get rid of you. Making so you don't get no boost from Liz as well. Decent, decent team, decent team. Um, now we gotta get rid of asking our HP real quick, as soon as possible. Honestly, as soon as possible. Yep, here we again. Not looking too good for me, honestly. It's not looking too good. Uh. I'm assuming like Liz is probably gonna do way more damage than I think Merlin's gonna do with her AOE. So I'm just gonna leave Merlin to go first and then Liz. Cause Liz is like HP base, which means more damage. And now we're gonna force revive on Escanor, which means now he's on final flames. So good luck. Let's see, he's, okay, he's attacking so. The final flame is gonna go down a little bit. And he attacks my Merlin. Racism. Definitely. Okay, so now he has only two revives to, to his name. Um, I mean, I could end up just doing this. <laughs> I could end up just doing like this for some, for some shenanigans. I low key wanted to use that gold card for a cool, like, thumbnail. But it's fine. I'll just do this for the for the memes. Ult. Call it a day. See ya. And see the win animation one more time. Beautiful. Alright, let's see. Can we get a good match for... Oh my god. I keep forgetting to put on CC food, dude. Holy snap. I swear. Like, if I put on CC food, I get mad bots. I get, like, like unimaginable bots. But the one moment where I don't put on CC food, real people, real people, real people, real people. Crazy. Well, I'm, about, I'm probably about to lose right here. So my team is based on Merlin debuffs. Oh, Eskinar going to blast me. Let's go. Let's go, Eskinar. Thank you, Eskinar, for blasting me first turn. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you, Eskinar. Appreciate it. And he has Red Tarmio Link on Gother. Let's go. The one time I don't get freaking. Oh my god, dude. All right, let's see. Can I can can I do something with this? Oh man, I almost almost misplayed. I almost misplayed. I can't lie to you. All right, let's see. What what, what can we do with this? I Loki almost misplayed by attacking Gother, who has like Red Tarmio Link. Especially because I I didn't know if I was gonna kill or not. So I I Loki almost misplayed. So my only hope right now is to hope that um I don't end up dying to Eskinar. Again, he's going to probably use his AoE, which is going to be gold for the most part. Um, I just hope he doesn't have a single target, though. He has double gold AoE. Nice. Nice game. Let's see what happens, though. And I'm getting blasted. I'm just casually getting blasted. Let's go. Okay, at least Liz is still alive. Liz Lizzo is still alive. So we didn't die in vain. 
All right, this might be a po possibility where I might make a comeback. Again, I'm kind of upset that um they always give me real people when I when I don't have CC food. It's so upsetting. All right. Okay, so I didn't proc my Liz passive, unfortunately, or I could have healed a lot more. Um, if Eskinor attacks, he's gonna lose his final flame. While well, I still have full HP for myself. Okay, if he's smart, he'll probably AOE. Yep, I would say yeah. If you're smart, he'll probably AOE, so you can do more damage. Now the game needs to love me right now and give me like either a gold AOE. Or massive amounts of cards. Uh, let's do this. So I can just finger finger bang his S, his um trade Meliodas after this. Cause remember guys, I still have full HP. Oh my god, is that a hopefully it's a AoE. His AoE is gonna do trash damage. I about to say this man is mad lucky. Alright, can I finger bang him right now? Do y'all think I can finger bang him? He went first and everything. With me not having no CC food. Let's see. Can I finger bang him right now? God dang. Eskiner is so good. Welp. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Um, see, this guy was even lucky, man. I even didn't have CC food on. And he still got clapped. What a lucky guy. But again, hope you guys enjoy. This is really guys. And I'm out. Peace.